Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you how to link your Outlook calendar to your Google calendar. So let's go. The first thing you want to do is jump onto your web browser and dial in outlook.live.com forward slash mail. It'll take you to your Outlook mailbox. And here we want to go up to our settings on the top right hand side. It's the gear icon. Now, once you're in here, you will see on the left hand side, you have a few options. You're going to go into calendar and from here, you're going to go into shared calendar. Now, from Shared Calendar, you are going to use this drop down and tap on the calendar that you would like to share. Once you're done, you will see that there is a select permissions and then you are going to select um, all permissions. Once you've done so, you will have this drop down menu with two links. Now, what you want to do is you want to click on the ICS link and tap on copy link. Here's the link and we're going to tap on copy. Now, if you go over to your Google Calendar, which you can access in your Google Apps on the top right hand side of your Chrome homepage, you can see on the left hand side here, there are other calendars and there is a plus button. Now, once you tap on that, you can tap on from URL and over here, you can now paste in the URL of the calendar that you just copied. Now, if you want to make this calendar public, you can do so. However, we're going to leave it just like this and then we're going to say add calendar, right? So what's going to happen is this calendar is now going to be added here and we're going to be able to manage this calendar here in our Google Calendar app. Now, if you want to sync them so that you are viewing everything on one calendar, you can simply check the boxes that you would like to check. So let's just, for example, um, if you hit the three dots, uh, you can recolor this calendar. Um, you can also toggle it on and off. If you also go into settings, you can name it. So you can actually call it Outlook Calendar and that's fine. Settings have now been saved. So now we've got our Outlook calendar here and what we want to do is we want to select it. So everything that you're seeing here now um, in your main calendar display is your Outlook calendar as well as the main calendar that we have here. If you would like to display any of these other calendars, you can just check them on and now you can manage it all in one place on your Google Calendar app. If this was helpful, drop us a like. We'll see you next time. Cheers.